We lose one life nearly every hour, each day, year after year. My child Dominic was one. Dominic was only 17 when he collapsed on a basketball court. No one around him knew what to do. I know a lot of people wish they had been prepared for that what if moment. If I saw a friend or a loved one collapse, uh, I would immediately move into action. You know, I'm a helper by nature. Uh, I want to be able to support my friends and, and give back in any way that I can. You know, as uh, I've taken a CPR, a course for professionals, two years already, and though you prepare yourself for that, I hope that day never comes. It would be sad and unfortunate, but the first thing I would do is call the paramedics because Again, I don't profess to be a doctor, uh, and I want to stay with that person to help comes because that's essential, you know. As a coach, I wouldn't want to see one of my kids collapse on the field, um, but if I did, I would immediately um, go into action and do the things that I've actually learned in the course. Uh, but I do remember taking this course, and this Staying Alive song has been in my head ever since, but I would know how to do those kind of compressions until help arrived. You know, I would make sure that someone calls 911, I would attend to the, ch uh, to the child in need or the person in need um, and then start CPR immediately um, and then make, uh, do it until um, the ambulance comes and the professionals take over. If someone collapsed and during, had cardiac arrest, I would, I would do whatever I could do for my CPR training to try to sa save them, but I'd also call 911 immediately. Someone I knew collapsed due to sudden cardiac arrest, I would try and stay calm and call 911 immediately and do all I can from the classes we had in school to save them until help arrived. And uh, if there was a defibrillator around, we'd go and grab that and do the best we can do to uh, bring them back to life. I can't imagine losing a loved one to sudden cardiac arrest, nonetheless witnessing it. I would try to jump in there, of course call 911, and try to calm the group that's around it instead of yelling and screaming. If I did witness one of my loved ones suffering from sudden cardiac arrest, I'll run quickly, call for help, perform hands-only compression, do anything just to make sure I save their life. And then go to the patient, of course, maybe tap in uh, and do whatever I can to resuscitate the person. I'm Melinda Murray, Dominic's mom. Sudden cardiac death is preventable. No child should be at risk due to lack of screening, training, or life-saving equipment. Screen CPR AED saves lives.